Hello, good day everyone, Rogelio here, and today we are going to learn about the human skeleton. So welcome to our science class. Our starter activity, fill in the blanks with the given words. Choices are move, calcium, 206, pretext, alive, strong, body, and blobs. Pause the video and write your answers. Time is up. Here are the answers. There are 206 bones in the human skeleton. Our bones are very strong. The skeleton does three very important jobs. It helps us to move around, it supports the body, and it protects the organs inside the body. Bones are made from calcium and they are very hard. They are alive and grow with us. Without our skeletons, we would look like blobs. Did you get all the correct answers? Well done. If not, stay tuned. Today's learning objective is to describe the parts of the human skeleton. Bones and skeletons. Within our bodies, we have many different parts which form our skeleton. These bones help to support and protect our bodies. Can you name the parts of my body? Pause the video and write your answers. Time is up. So here are the parts of the human skeleton. We got skull, rib cage, spine, hand bones, foot bones, scapula, and the pelvis. What do bones do? Our bones make up our skeleton. An adult has 206 bones in their skeleton. Our skeleton supports our body and protects our organs. Without the skeleton, we would just be one big wobbly jelly. What do bones help us do? Some bones help us move. Bones in the hands and arms help us lift and carry. Bones in the legs help us run and jump. Where two bones join together, this is called a joint. Bones are held together at joints by tough fibers called ligaments. More about bones. Bones are made of living tissue. Each bone has its own special name. Bones are made up of several layers. About half of the bone is just water. The skull. The skull. There are 29 bones altogether in the skull and jaw. They make a box to protect the brain, eyes, and ears. The rib cage. This protects the heart and lungs and other upper organs. There are 24 curved bones and sternum runs down the middle. The spine. It is made up of 24 individual small bones called vertebrae. Your spine supports your head and body. Each of the bones are linked by small joints which can move a little. Lots of small movements and add up and let your spine bend a lot. The hand bones. There are lots of bones in your hands. There are bones in your wrists or the carpals, palms or metacarpals and fingers or the phalanges. Foot bones. There are 26 bones in your foot. They can make an arch shape to support your body when you stand up. The leg bone, also known as femur. It is the longest, largest, and strongest bone of the human body. It forms part of the hip and part of the knee. Femur, patilla. Pelvis. Your pelvis is shaped like bowl. It holds all of the organs in the lower part of the body. It is a slightly movable joint. Now, for our plenary, answer the given question. You may write only the letter of the correct answer. Which part of the skeleton protects the brain? A. Ribs B. Backbone or C. Skull 
The correct answer is letter C, skull. What part of the skeleton protects the heart and lungs? A, ribs, B, backbone, or C, skull? The correct answer is letter A, ribs or rib cage. And finally, which animal has its skeleton on outside of its body? A, the wood loose, B, the buffalo, or C, the piranha? The correct answer is letter A, the wood loose. The woodless scale is part of its skeleton. I hope you have learned something new today. Thank you so much for watching my video. Till next time, always remember, be the best you can. Bye.